<laughs> I brought it back. I don't know. Did I promise? I, 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 like, I didn't look back at the last video that I recorded. But, uh, did I promise this? Because I was really doubting if I should, because I was lazy and just wanted to record the video. But I decided, fuck it, you know, I bring back Draco Belly Cam. Because I don't know, to be honest, like, how long this series is gonna be still. In max, I think three episodes. Assuming that what I think takes long, this episode will take long. The next episode will probably be only Elite Four. Um, like, I think a minimum of two, max three. But, if you ever not remember last episode, I slowly forgot to catch Groudon. I forgot. I, uh, I tell you. <laughs> I forgot to catch Groudon, and I was like, oh yeah. <laughs> if you haven't watched, uh, oh, I should make a clip of that, now that I think about it. I should make a TikTok clip of that. Like, and we did Gym 8, so... We can go to the Elite 4 now. And which is around here. And if you don't... <laughs> so. If you don't remember our last team. Then, uh... Our custom main team is now this still. Len, our uh, Flygon, Pumpert, Itran, uh, Makita. You know, I'm gonna say, honestly. Kaito has been proven his usefulness this run. And there has been a few close colors where... Makihita was useful or necessary. And normally in my own playthrough, I wouldn't use Makihita that much. But see now, now I got this and I've been using it the whole run through. Metagross has appeared also as like replacement for Kiran because I thought this is where we wanted to for. We did the eight gems, so we now we can teach Waterfall to one of our Pokemon. I'm not saying correctly. Massive baby bump doesn't help at all, but. Like sitting with your Glex cross for a long time while pregnant, not something you want. Uh, so this is going to be the team heading to for uh, the island on the corner left right here, there above me. That should be the road to Victory Plateau. You weren't here before. Oh. Like, I don't know if Ground and Respawn yet because it's a different day. But I think Kaunon only spawns after the Elite Four. So <laughs> But I've proven to this to this run that I don't need Kaunon. I don't need. I don't need Kaunon. I should button Rapal now that I think about it. I should. But where does this go to? Like Was this from where we came up from, like, the thing? If an Alex. Oh, now I want ice cream. Ooh. That's sitting correctly. Maybe if I just sit. Maybe I'm sitting, like, way too close up of, like... <laughs> yeah, maybe that's it. Maybe I'm sitting way too close up. And now I want... But now I want ice cream. I don't have to think about it. I have to do it. Oh. I hope you didn't catch that, but... Is it where we came up from, like, the water cave? I should go to the Elite Four, just fuck it, like, I don't need... I already have this. Shiny and all. Did I get a shiny one last time? I don't think I did. I made it shiny because I added rare candies to the game. What does this lead to? Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna properly, I hope. Hit this properly. But if this is not in the way, you can see my beautiful. <laughs> Big Petty. <laughs> like, I'm like, I'm adding, I'm adding into my 21 big uh, and I'm like, so, like, don't they realize me, like, when I talk to my, like, online sister pudding, but, like, from last stream that I did. There is, like, I've been building my channel around this baby bump. Oh! 
Hold on. Okay, hold on. This is a shortcut? Ew. And, like, I've been building around it, but... There is gonna be a time where I'm not pregnant anymore. And I have to rebrand my channel back to, like, normal Elise. Of, like... I'm gonna have bigger tits, that's for sure. But I already had, like, huge airbags. But... There's gonna be a time where I have to go back. At like, I've talked, I've like close contact with my gynecologist Emma uh, at the point when I record this video. And my babies, in my, like, babies I'm carrying do seem to grow slower than a normal average human once she starts. And uh, looking how I come from, like, how I'm not coming from this place or this world, uh, I don't know how that works. But I'm supposed to be 30 weeks or 30 to 31 weeks pregnant. And she said, Elise, uh, normal babies that, like, humans will carry uh, are supposed to be, like, a size of tomato. What of, what was it? Like, tomato, watermelon. They should be big. Hold on. Hold on. Maybe I can Google it. The size. 30 X wins. She said, if I forget, just Google it again. Ten and a half inches from counter room this week. They weigh three pounds each week. Thirty years in the growth and start lagging behind the growth of their singleton counterpart. Oh, they're going to ten and a half inch. Normally, that's big. So, oh, that's for normal. But, was it an... Emma didn't use a cucumber. Like, Emma didn't say cucumber, but... I have a lot of back pain, that's for sure. Like, this this health line website says... Uh, my baby should be the size of cucumber. So, ten and a half inch. So, and this website says there's one six, and they weigh each three to one pound, they should. But, I oh, that was it. Yeah, that's true. Uh, I must said indeed, now that I see this website again, it was something green I knew. But, uh, this website also says it. By 30 weeks in the twin pack, your twins are each nearly 61 uh, inch six from head to foot. And that's the average size of a cabbage. So expect to pick cabbages in here that I'm carrying, but for some reason, mine uh, and my sets are lagging behind and are like 15 to 14 weeks. Or is what she said. So my, like, I do have the belly of a 30 week uh, pregnant woman. So, I am, like, 30 weeks, but, uh... They're, like, they're either growing really, really slow. Like, they're either growing really slow, or... Uh... Like... What, what I said is true, that they take up to three years. And, like, uh, Emma says uh, already, like, Elise... Uh, three years or not, expect to be going overdue if you're like normally 36 weeks pregnant. Expect like at least six weeks of overdue. And six weeks is like 42 weeks. Now it's 45 weeks pregnant, eh? She said, she said at this rate of growing, if your baby's like, if your like children keeps growing at the same rate they do now, uh, you will be expected to give birth at 52 weeks. So a year. So Emma says I should be expecting to give birth at 52 weeks. She wants to keep close contact uh, just in case. Because, you know, regarding my special situation. And maybe I've just lack of underdevelopment in my... Uh, ch my children have lack of under like underdevelopment. I don't feed them well or something. But I seem healthy, and the baby seemed healthy according to Emma's words, so... How did I go back up again? Is that here? Uh, 
Like, it, I seem to be healthy at 30 weeks and 29 weeks, so... Like, there was nothing stopping me for that. So, like, Emma wants to keep close contact with me. Or just in case I get contractions or something like that. Oh, do I have to get down and find a way? I think I have to find a way and get down. So, yeah. At this rate, if uh, her expectation is right, I am a year pregnant. I'm gonna be a year pregnant before I can safely deliver these babies. Because she's like, Elise, if this goes on for like the rest of your like five to six weeks, then I have to hate to tell you, but uh, it's probably gonna happen that you uh, not will be in a or your babies will not be in a healthy state to d be delivered by either surgery or uh, manual labor. So just keep close contact with me, Elise, and it should be fine. How do I get there? Do the whole thing. Oh, do I have to get all the way around? Take it all the way around. So, yeah, like she said, like the expectation now stands for a year pregnancy at my rate. So, the only thing she said, like Elise, I don't know what would be true in your case anymore because you're a trans girl, as she said. Well, clearly having the uterus and the ability to get pregnant. Like, that was the weirdest part. Like, she said, like, Elise, it's from this, from, it looks like you got the uterus from the start. Which means that all the time me and Ellie have had sex before. Before I got, like, a, a relationship with Lilia and Ellie. Like, all the times we had sex before, we were just unlucky. And I just never felt the men menstruation, menstruation cycle. So... Like, do I have to get from, like, here? So, that's just one thing. So, probably me and Ali haven't been lucky, I guess. So, but, like, yeah, the only worrying thing now is that my babies don't grow as they're supposed to be. And if we would, like, let me carry... According to the accumulated rate they're going now, I should be like a year pregnant, at least. So. What did they get a year pregnancy? I thought that was three. Wait, what? And I can't I go this way? Do I have to get... You tell me that I have to dive... ...from this... ...city... ...to get here? I have to probably dive. This is why I mean three episodes. Uh, this is why I mean three episodes. Because of this. But yeah, like, so yep, the pregnant trans girl is gonna get a year, and then I have to take. I probably have to, like, soon get, like, rest and prepare, like, a mental state so that I can't, like. That's one thing I've been doing well. Like, I keep streaming, I keep making content, I keep going to work because I didn't expect to be that much, but. Yeah. So I didn't expect it to be much, but yeah. I still have the energy to do, but I do feel less, more and more tired. So maybe I should take like mental breaks and do recording less. But who knows? Who knows? Like I'm still happy that I could get the chance to get pregnant once. How do I get to the thing to the right here again? Over here and down here, I guess. A torco in the water. Hmm. But yeah, like I'm not 30 weeks, and if it's 52, then I've 22 more weeks to go. And it's gonna be like, like that's the thing when I like was 
my sister, like online sister, like online sister, Pudding Bats came by in chat again last time, and uh, yeah, she pointed me to like she was pregnant too, and I completely missed her message last time about that. So one thing is true. She said to me, no matter how long I will be pregnant, I'm. Oh, really? Like, no matter how long I am pregnant, it's gonna end someday, and. Yeah, I know she's true, but. Like, I've been building my channel on this. I could buy fake bellies and just keep wearing fake bellies, you would never know, but. Now, I've been building the channel around my pregnant belly. Or being my pregnant. But if I just only be in a year pregnant, uh. Uh, yeah. But that reminds me, like, I have a girlfriend now. Imagine if my girlfriend and I get pregnant. That we both get pregnant. Like, I would, like... You have, like, a citrus berry? I didn't do anything. Like, imagine if she gets pregnant and then I get pregnant again. Like, ever since I got, like, my poly relationship with Lilia and Elliot, like, the idea of her being pregnant... Like, that we're both pregnant together then, and like, cuddle together or something with our bellies and like... Uh, I don't know, it keeps thinking of me. I keep thinking of it. Like, I have to say, my... Uh, maybe I can borrow one from her. She, like... I think I infected Lilia with like... Uh, how do you call it? My pregnancy virus? Or... Or whatever you wanna call it. Oh yeah, I need waterfall for this. Like, I have been like, Lilia has like, I, I think I affected her with like, uh, pregnancy virus or something. She has such a sweet spot for pregnant women, huh? I think, uh, like, I think, to be honest, Lilia is like a pregnancy fetish. So. Or she just really, really loves me and want to be pregnant too, because she thinks I look amazing, because she looks amazing too. I have to say, she looks amazing with the bump, but... E. So, yeah. The woman has been wearing a fake belly. A fake, like, she has a lot... She has a fake belly. Or two. Like, she has one or two. I forgot how many she has. But she's been wearing it a lot. And a lot. Ever to the point that I assume uh, she wants to get pregnant too. And she already explained to me, like, Elise, would you, like, would you take in children with me and I'd be like well I'm still carrying LDFs and mine and mine but uh, if I'm like we can we can choose like if I'm like uh, if I gave birth to the children of mine LDF, if we could choose that I get pregnant again or if you want to get pregnant or we could choose like that we try both you know that like you just have sex with the three of us and then if one of us gets pregnant then so be it and if the other gets pregnant too, then bonus, yeah, you know, win-win. And she was like, Oh, well, Elise, what if we just have sex with the three of us? And if I get pregnant, you're still pregnant. And then I was like, Elia, if you want kids with Elif, you know, because we're in a poly relationship, I, I, these are mine and Elif's children now, but they get an aunt. That's an aunt too. But, like, I was like, if you want children with Elif, I'm not going to stop you, but do remind me. That I'm still pregnant. I'm still carrying children of uh, my boyfriend. Uh oh. Like I'm still carrying children of my boyfriend. So if you want like children with me, like then you have to get pregnant, or we have to get, like or we have to do adoption or IFV. So you know. And, and why do I save? I just almost like clicked away, clicked away the video. So or clicked away the stream. Oh, you know what happened? Like that happened to one of one went to Weather Institute. Oh, do I need strength? I need fucking strength for this.
But yeah, like, so, like, she really wants to get pregnant. And she's been talking, like, oh, Elise, so you don't mind if I and Elliot get kids and I get pregnant and then, like... But, like, I don't mind that your relationship between the two of you. I just, like, I just, like, I would like if he keep loving me too, instead of only Elif. So, you know. They have been cuddling a lot, and they've been trying, I feel like. And while well, they're trying, which Pokemon should I get strength? Let's do it again. But yeah, like she's been like, I know she's been trying with Elif, and of course, once those two try, I get occasionally pleasure of it too, but. Uh, yeah, I had told her like, do you know that like being pregnant is not all that fun, you know? Like being pregnant is not all that fun. Yeah, I do look good and cute, but, uh. I also have back pain, nausea, you know, I have ache in my boobs. These things are hurt so much. And you know, your your clothing closer will not thing. But no matter what I try, no matter what I do. Like no matter what I try, no matter what I say, that woman doesn't get like pregnant pregnancy out of her head. So He doesn't get pregnancy out of her head. And the Tori trainer. So. Like, I don't, like. I think we're Chinese, though. A good Chinese, though. Like, I have, like. I tried to talk it out of her mind, but I don't mind her, like. I would, like, I wouldn't mind if she's pregnant. I wouldn't mind that. But. To, like, with, between the three of us start a family of, like, 10,000 kids. You know, that wouldn't be a good one. And you could say, like, at least you could always, like, be pregnant and, uh, put them up for adoption. I know, we could. Like, Elif and me have been thinking about it. Like, putting them up for the adoption since I'm still in college and I should, uh, you have a Rayquaza? I think this level 94. But yeah, like, we have been thinking about adoption because uh, I, I still in college and I'm not doing my final internship. And uh, like, we don't think like we are ready, or at least to like prepare to give birth, or like take care of twins. So, like we think we're like I got pregnant with two kids because it's maybe my only time that I get to get pregnant. You know, this thing is gonna kill my whole team. Like, this may be my only chance, but we're not, we're, we think we're not ready yet to give, like, or take care of children. I live once, but I think I'm not ready. Like, I live like, well, I can take care of them. Like, I will come home dead, but like, uh, or, or home dead, or work more from home, you know. And now that we have, like, a relationship with Lilia, she can help too. And Lilia was like, hey, you two wanted to have kids? Your problem. <laughs> hmm. And I was like, well, yeah, I like, I know you're, you want, you want the family, honey. Like, I know you want the family, honey, but I don't know, I don't know if I'm ready for it. I don't have revives. No, I do have revives. So, you know, like, I don't know if I'm ready for it. 
But I feel like I'm, I feel like becoming a monster. Maybe I'm ready for it. Maybe I should just keep them because I might never know if I can get pregnant again. I don't have heals. Wait. You might never know if I get pregnant again. So. Never know. It's the same game. This is the last time, and we. I have the puzzle. The wrong way. I think it was the wrong way. But yeah, like, I don't know if I can get pregnant again. If I do, it happens, but... And if I don't, it doesn't happen. No. It happens. But, yeah, I don't know if I'm ready for, like, to be every kiss, but my mother instinct has... My mother instinct has really gone over the last few weeks, eh? Oh. You know that sometimes you like, uh, make, like... An Oh, my voice. You know, you sometimes make like a uh, comment on something and then you be like, if I was a mother, I would be a good damn mother. Yeah, I've been doing that a lot. And a few people on work said, like on the internship said, at least, you really, uh, like, at least you really get it like mother uh, vibes, eh? And be like, isn't that supposed to be logical if you're like pregnant? And, she was like, and, and they were like, yeah, that happens. But like, uh oh. And a few of my colleagues like still look at me like, Elise, I need to choose to have kids. And I was like, I need I need to choose for it. I need to know I could get kids. I was in here. Oh, there was, oh, there was a PP up. I didn't expect like a victory road like okay, can't those things. Oh, is this a mandatory battle again? So yeah. Like I do love being pregnant and people like worshipping you because you have a belly feels so goddamn good. But yeah, with this comes the responsibility of children. And uh we're still deciding if we want to keep these two. And maybe like you know what we decided if i can get pregnant again according to emma too like we decided to maybe be that i become like a surrogate mother that i become like a mother who carries children for others because that means that i can have the fun of being pregnant but without the responsibility of like being an adult afterwards and we just decided maybe to keep the we're maybe gonna decide to keep these two uh so that like we have our own kids but if i can get pregnant again and if me have like this like Thought about me, uh, me becoming like a surrogate mother, if that's the word. Like, if this is the word, like, imagine that I'm carrying kids for somebody else because they can get pregnant. Uh, did you get like something like that? Clacky. Is that a shiny clacky? All right. Oh, I want to do earthquake. It has play off. Yeah. I wanted to do Earthquake. Damn it, I don't have any more revives. But yeah, like... Uh, I don't have the word Circle Mother, but... Uh, just, a mo just someone, like a woman who carries children for others. You know? So that I become pregnant, I, for example, like... Uh, a pregnant of in this case triplets because I know IFE if you do like an IFE transplantation that the chance to get pregnant is higher and a okay, pregnant of twins and uh, triplets so let's for example say that I uh, I become pregnant of my uh, like my trans sister or my online trans sister Reshi like example that I get pregnant for her I start to get Did that thing use high jump kick and missed? 
Oh, that makes it easier. But yeah, just example like that, I become pregnant for my trans online trans sister Reshi, and I become pregnant of triplets. You know, that I just carry the kids, and uh, eventually when I deliver, I hand them over to Reshi, you know. As she has kids with her relationship on my feet. Evermelt eyes. Ooh, that's actually a good item. I don't know if we can make it to Victory Road alive. So, but yeah. Like, a surrogate, I think it's surrogate mother, but let me know in the comments down below if it's another word, because I am not good at English. I'm just gonna tell you that. Oh. Alright, I have Ice Beam, so this shouldn't be a problem. Level 94. Oh, that hurts. I, I real, you know what I realized? I did my electric move on the one and only Pokemon who's weak to flying. <laughs> I'm not gonna win this. What is this one? Like, what would survive a brave bird? Oh yeah, Luca. Luca has like bullet barns, which is priority. A shiny medic rose. Oh, that's what I've been doing for. That's why, that is why I went back and called the Bellum, you know? That's why we called the Bellum for this. I think, I think, if, like, I think if I early in the run added like the rare candies, this run would be a piece of cake. But, like, I learned Pokemon again. Like, I, I learned Pokemon again, and that's why I love about the series. I need to go down there, or not? Like, I relearned Pokemon again, I learned a bit of team building, and yeah. It is not always just the easiest part, but hey. Oh, which way do I have to... Oh, no. This is gonna be a long one. If I can get the delete for that would be a good video for today. I think, yeah. But, like, I think, like, to get back to the story. Ah, uh, the little cute little cutie cat. I get intimidated by that. Like, to get back to the story. Uh, yeah. If I could get... If I have the ability to become a surrogate mother... Then, yes, I would, I think. I don't want to do a double battle. Like, I don't have any anything healing anymore, huh? Oh, I, do have, to, I have to do a mandatory battle. Oh, I don't want to talk. Shut up. Uh, this is uh, not a good. Uh... This is not a good matchup. I expect a ground move, so. If I don't see a ground move, I'm gonna be pissed. Fighting. Oh, yeah, fighting works too. It should be quite effective, so... And crit and kills. Oh, and... I always know how to clutch, eh? Why do I keep forgetting to buy rappels? But yeah, imagine me being the surrogate mother and be like, Elise, are you pregnant again? And be like, yes. I'm just giving the like I'm giving the option to other people around the world to have kids, you know. Maybe that's my purpose in life. Maybe I was sent to this planet to like carry children for children for others. Maybe that was it. Yeah. 
Maybe that was my goal on this planet. To carry children for other people. Oh wait, does this go? Or maybe that was my goal. To become pregnant for others and carry children for people all over the world who can't. Is that a shiny? Oh, I, 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 I want to say that one would, would be a shiny. If I, if I was playing Scarlet and Violet and disappeared in the overworld without any others, I wouldn't say that one would be a shiny. Oh, God damn it. Oh, yeah. But yeah. Maybe that's my goal. Now I see that head is more pink. Okay, maybe now I see it, but... Yeah, maybe that was my goal. Like, every person is sent to this world. Like, maybe I was sent to this realm on my own world because I will be hyper fertil fertilized. No. Maybe I have, to have a high chance to get pregnant. Maybe that's it. Maybe I found a true purpose in life. To carry children for people who can't in this world. That would be weird to, to, to think about it. I have to do a double battle. Maybe that is weird. Maybe that's but maybe my goal is weird. I've been always been a weird person, so. And if this takes a year, I will be happy. Like it's like I got the chance to be pregnant once. It's been such a world. Of... It's been such a wonderful experience. Sky attack? Oh, you're gonna do sky attack. Dirty, of Ah, uh, I was expecting that. Does Rin need to be alive? Please don't tell me that I'm now softlocked because Rin is not alive. Make all crits on this virus, but yeah. Maybe, maybe I got like a... Maybe that's my Mark's power. A part of my Mark's power. I did get big boobs after all, so maybe I'm like highly fertilized. Or have a high chance to get pregnant every time. But that wouldn't want to be like... That wouldn't explain... Wouldn't that explain why the many times I had sex with LDF before wouldn't work? You know, I had sex with Elliot many, many times before. Maybe, you know, maybe it's just like something that I have to discover how to learn. That like my, my goal is to become like hyper fertilized. Don't tell me we have to battle. Or oh, release. It's only because of the fact that you can be even stronger. I'm sure your Pokemon have come, come a lot too. I read Archon so much, and I finally can see what we all can do. No, no battle. No. Can you heal my Pokemon first? But yeah, that would feel like why I have such a high sex type, but that also can be my... And also can just be my uh, pregnancy hormones.
Oh, the closest could be my pregnancy hormones, but yeah. Like, even before I got pregnant, like, uh, I did have a high, high sex drive with, like, LAF. So, maybe that's it. Maybe my powers are, like, also beyond, like, becoming a V idol, also having fertilized powers, which would be weird, but. I'm not gonna win this. I'm getting burned, watch. I knew it! I had half the attack on my... I have to walk all the way back, eh? I have no attack on this thing. Uh, if I knew this, then I wouldn't... <laughs> That kid. Okay. If I know this, I will have bought revives. 10k? I have to avoid also so many trainers now again, huh? Is there a shop here? No, of course not. I would you? Uh, but yeah. So... Uh, that would be like, that would explain a lot in my past that I have fertilized powers. I, I know it sounds weird, but hey. Let's explain something. And it would explain why a trans girl like me can get pregnant in your world because of our fertilized powers that I never discovered. And if it's something like, uh, if it's something like my mark that I have to discover it first, before it works, you know, before I can understand the powers, then. I want to explain a lot, but whatever. I think I, well, I think I think I talked enough about my pregnancy. Uh, I can't wait to be used to a good water. But yeah, like, but uh, like the thing is, a year at this rate, I would be a year pregnant. Emma said. So. Oh, uh, instead of the three years a year, which is two years quicker, but oh well. One thing is gonna keep these huge ass, huge looking boobs. Ooh, like I'm, 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 I'm just, I'm gonna be honest. They are good play. You can play really well with them, and yeah, I am a YouTuber, so that you know. But you can play really well with my boobs, and I, I, I wouldn't like, I wouldn't want to make you jealous, but. uh Ilya and Elif both. Sorry, sorry, I have to stop. There are children in the room. As you can see, there are children in the room. Hold, hold, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. We'll wait for a sec. It's gone. Oh. I don't want children to hear what I'm about to say. But yeah, like I said, Elif and Lilia, uh, they have been enjoying my boobs and especially my pregnancy boobs, so. I guess it's part of being pregnant and a poly relationship, huh? <laughs> the thing looks so happy. <laughs> the thing looks way too happy. But yeah, this, I guess this is a part of being in a poly relationship that your partners enjoy your pregnancy as much as you do. And especially Lilia, that woman. Ugh. I can't get I can't get over it on how she like knows how to plushy me. I've been saying that a lot of videos. Oh, the child's back. Hold on. Shh, shh. We weren't saying anything, anything uh, naughty, child. Will be. We're just talking about candy. 
Uh, don't worry. We were just talking about candy. That doesn't make the sound better. <laughs> uh, but yeah, like... Lillian, oh, she knows how to pleasure a woman and I hate it. She knows how to pleasure me and every time. Like, once she makes me come. Oh yeah, I forgot you. <sighs> of course you have two Pokemon and you have a Greninja. But once she makes me come, oh, it is every, good every goddamn fucking time. Ooh. Okay, land your comedy clutch. I don't need you. I don't want you to take any damage now. Oh, uh, but yeah. Like, Elliot knows how to push me too and make me come. But I don't know. Something with Lilia makes it feel way, way better. I don't know. The woman makes. Ugh. Thinking about it makes me moody again. But this thing. That's Dragon Pills, I know that, but this is quicker than me. Oh. Like, uh. Like, she. When she. Eats me. Or, you know, fingers me. Just like the heaven. Uh, Aliyah can do it too, but, like, I think. Table Knight. Like. Elif knows how to do it too, but I think I have like I think that's the part of like being just being like for a month in a poly relationship at this point. Uh that you like that you uh experience sex with a different partner, you know, and that it becomes amazing. Uh, that it feels amazing. And that your old your first partner, you know, you're the one that you're engaged to. Like yeah, I Elif asked me to marry. So we're still working on like a date for the marriage, but I haven't seen shinies in for ages, in ages, and now they're popping up left and right again. It's like shiny victory road. Oh no, that is exactly on the spot that the guy looks. But yeah, like, uh, maybe that's it. Maybe because I have a new partner and I have sex with her, that the sex feels different than with my old partner. I do have to say one thing is different. One is tits and the other one is a dick, but that's for sure. You know, that's for sure. But. And uh, maybe it's also known that like Lilia knows what a woman wants. Because she's a woman herself. And Elliot, like, he tries, but sometimes... Eh. <laughs> uh, my husband is gonna hate that saying me saying this. My husband is gonna hate me saying it. I'm gonna... I also gonna be honest, I didn't expect a Wally fight here. Let me save so that I don't lose any more money. Plus, yeah, Houndoom was the first one, huh? Yeah, yeah, blah, 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 blah. We know you be become stronger and want to battle us, so get to the point. I am pregnant, like, I don't have all the time. And now I wonder what their mega Pokemon is gonna be. Their mega ace. Maybe it's Gardevoir. Because normally he catches a Rolt, so that didn't change. Uh, this is gonna hurt. But this should hurt too. Not this thing again. Yeah, 
Future shite. Uh, time to kill it. Just to think, guy. If I if I just had flight on it, I had two more Pokemon KOs. I need to kill her this turn, otherwise I get the future side attack. Oh, I still take it. Rip. Oh. Yes. Rip, rip, rip. And the question who comes in next? I had to choose first, which is stupid, but. And what the? Oh, that thing. A ground water type. Ooh. If it has a ground move, that wouldn't be a good one. So uh, let's switch into Miku. Or it's like an ice but like ice beam. So just hydro pump. Just hydro pump. But yeah, like my pregnancy is a weird one and I love being it. And if I have fertilized powers, then I'm gonna use them for good and not for evil. Like, I'm not gonna make an evil elite army and take over the world. That would be a fun thing. Do anything. It's frozen! You frozen this? That does fucking more than my fucking. Oh. He fought? Wait, this thing is water ground, right? How are you going from missing two hydro pumps to getting frozen on the first turn to hitting two hydro pumps in a row? I wanna see something. I wanna see something real quick. Hello, where's my internet browser? Hello. Oh, I just wanna open Firefox. I don't wanna solve any fucking issues. Tara. Cara Costa. Oh, it's water rock. Oh, it's water rock type. Oh, see, that's what I mean with learning this game. I never, I never know. If you hit an elder hydro pump. I was thinking, I thought it was water ground. I, and I still think I don't have a gas move. Be quicker, be quicker, be quicker, be quicker, be quicker. No, it's not quicker. That's fighting steel, right? Uh, Swords of Justice. I take a risk here. If the thing is quicker, make was that, probably. That's quicker, god damn it. That didn't hit, that didn't kill. Not very effective. That wouldn't mean it has resistance. It's steel, no it's not steel then. This thing is killing my team because it's just close combating everyone. Survive. It's now at minus four special defense and attack. This should kill, right? 
Was ist hier für eine Gerät? Farfetched. Hey Miku! The thing is quicker than Makita or like the evolution. This level 96. The thing is a flying type, right? Is it? Is it is the flying type? Why is Farfetch'd a store in the Netherlands? <laughs> the things you learn by googling. It's normal flying? I thought it was fighting. Oh, this is Ace then. Oh, a Mega Ken Gash Ken. Oh. Ken Gash Ken. This is so cute, eh? Sucker Punch. Nerd. Wait, why does it hit two times? I'm slower now. Priority bullet punch! That's gonna hit two hours. I don't know how Kendrin take this. Uh oh, this is gonna hurt. That hit twice time, so I can't survive. He tells the. That kills, thank you. I gave you 10k, what did you do with the other 7? Arr! Ah! At least you and your Pokemon too. Thank you for not holding back when you battled against us. For not holding back when you beat us and... Galate, everyone, thank you so much. I feel like I've been able to take another step forward thanks to you. Oh yeah, you got a Galate instead of a... Order for. Oh no, I gave you this to keep. I hope it always reminds you of your battle with me and with Galate and the rest of my team. You didn't have a Galate. Yeah, you didn't have a Galate. Where was your Galate then? I have a, if you have a male Kera as one of your partners, Elise, I hope that you might use the dance zone on it for me. I'm gonna beat you this time, Elise, but I'll stay here and continue training. And one day, look out, I swear I'll catch up to you. One day. And then do a promise to battle again that I promise I intend to live up to. Now get out of the way and let me access the victory road. If Brandon comes in and wants to fight, finally. If Brandon wants to come in and wants to fight, I swear to fucking old. Let me walk in peace, yes, thank you. What's this? Mewtwo Knight, I! Oh! I make a Mewtwo! Okay, we're here. We're here by the Leaf 4, which means this video is exactly an hour long, which is exactly is my time. Uh, well, I'm doing this, I'm gonna say, if you're new around here and uh, don't know who I am, I'm known as Atsun Elisa Ratsun GG, a pregnant transgender poly girl on the internet. Or, uh, you know, you just can call me pregnant trans girl, prego, prego Elise. Uh, I don't mind. But, uh, one thing is for sure, as you can see, 
I'm pregnant, I'm highly pregnant. Or do they say high pregnant? I'm at least 30 weeks pregnant at this point when I'm recording this. And may maybe I got fertilized powers that I learned of, who knows. But uh, as I said, one thing is for sure, as you can see, oh, she pick up at least baby's bump. Oh no, wait, this is my uh, machinery bump thing. But as you can see, I do have a baby belly bump. Oh. I do have a baby belly bump. And uh, yeah, if you're new around here and don't know who I am, I'm Hudson Elise, Hudson Juju. You're a pregnant trans girl on the internet. You can call me pregnant VTuber, pregnant enemy girl, however you want to call me. One thing is for sure. And I am Prego. As you can see. Uh, but I do primarily Project Diva and Horror on my YouTube channel. If you're interested, make sure to check out the Let's Play playlist on my channel or the 3 Sky Game playlist. They feature the content I just described for you and I show you how I evolved as the girl that I am today. From a normal girl to getting big boobs and to getting my Prego state and to getting the huge boobs that I have today. Everything comes by in this journey. And maybe you'll find a video in there that you like and be like, Elise, go to... Like, go to another series on this, it was fun, you know, and those sorts of stuff, who knows. I don't know, I, I, I just make these videos, I don't watch them, so if you like them, make sure to subscribe, ring the notification bell, so I know I'm the correct way, and I know I should do more of these types of videos. But as I said, I focus primarily on Project Diva and Horror, but also do lots of less plays besides this, like the Call of Duty Veteran campaign series on my channel. I've done several Minecraft series, or attempted to do several Minecraft series, but lost interest. I've done inscription. Uh, you call it, I probably have done it on my channel. Uh, like I said, if you want to see what I've done on my channel, make sure to check out the Let's Play playlist. If you want to see my horror, uh, what I've done in regards to horror content, make sure to check out the 3 Scary Game playlist on my channel. Uh, if you want to see my Project Diva, there's our own separate Miku things on the channel. And you can find that. If you want to see some examples of what I do on my Let's Plays, make sure to check the i corner in the top right. And uh, don't forget to subscribe, ring the notification bell so that you don't won't miss any future updates of the videos. And that I know I should do more of these types of videos. Uh, also, if you want to support me, make sure to join my Discord down below. And uh, why do I say that? You get better notifications when I upload the video. You get also way more access. And you get way more access. Uh, what do you call it? Like you get way more access to me as a content creator, you can talk to me, make suggestions and that sort of stuff. You can be a part of my community. It's a small Discord community at the moment. And if you wanna, uh, if you wanna support me more precisely, that there is a Patreon link in the description down below. In case you want to like, I don't know, support me more as a prego person. And if you wanna support me more. Like if you wanna support me more. Make sure to check it out, you get access to a pregnancy journey, pregnancy thoughts, uh, private discord community, and such stuff. Like you get access to that pre 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 so pregnancy journey, pregnancy thoughts, private discord community, and all those sorts of stuff. And shoutouts, maybe you end up like uh, Solly, Solly Arigato for still being my only, uh, for being my only paying Patreon member at the moment. Let me double check because I do have someone on Patreon who uh, cancelled their subscription, which can, but I'm not going to include you in the video then anymore. So, which will explain why he never, why K never answered to that. Now, Solly is still the only paying member, so Solly is the only one who gets a shout out, and it maybe he can make me, uh, he can make me go like like a shout out screen at the end. Who knows? Because I get too many shout out people. But if you want to support me more, all of my social links are in the description down below. And with that, I'm going to say have a wonderful time. This Pekka girl is going to head out into bed after editing this video. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.